Hey guys, oh, <laughs> I left my glasses in the bathroom. I can't see anything. How are you? It is day 20. Okay. Um, I still have to do yesterday's vlog and get this up. So I might play with that for a little bit. I was just talking to dad on the phone. I got to go into work early because we're doing a little gift exchange between the six of us, the staff that work together. Um, I got my ho 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 sweater on, but I don't know if I should wear this today or if I just should wear something else. But it's like the last day before Christmas. When the hell else am I going to wear this? Thing? <laughs> I FaceTimed dad for a little while this morning. They delivered um, all the gifts and stuff that they had compiled and took it to the police station for the guy. And it, it went really well, dad said, and he was all excited. So that was really good. I tried to tidy my craft room a little bit last night. Um, I've asked the children to empty the dishwasher while I'm at work today. They're taking today off. They both came down with a case of, because today's the last day, but they both came down with a case of Christmas fever. I told the <laughs> attendance lady yesterday um, that they didn't seem to be feeling well. And she's like, oh, uh-huh. <laughs> but my class will probably all be there except for one kid that we know is not going to be there. Um, so yeah, so it's going to be a good last day of work before Christmas break. Ooh, ooh. And I'm going to do the housework upstairs, which I didn't do. I did the main floor the other night. Um, I hate doing that, but I will do a whole housework again probably Saturday. Um, today is just Wednesday. So I'll at least get it somewhat tidy and clean up there, and then I'll do a full big housework on Saturday. And then for Christmas Eve, everything will be nice, and the house will be clean and cozy. And I have to finish doing something with this. I put the, I have this spray. It feels so gross. I have this spray. Let me get it. I'll show you. I'll show you the secret to my dark hair when it's in between um, appointments. So this is called Wow. It's Color Wow. And I get this in a dark brown. Everyone says my hair is black. It's really dark brown if you look at it closely. Um, and then I have this. It's Root Concealer that I got. I got this at Ulta. Rita something something. Root concealer in dark brown slash black. <laughs> okay, maybe it is close to black. Um, and it's just like a little teeny tiny spray nozzle. And I just sprayed it up through here, but then I gotta scrub my head tonight and get that out of there because when you go to get the dye put on, I'm having that done tomorrow um, afternoon. See, I still have this blank spot. Um, it the, the dye won't stick to this stuff, so I have to make sure I scrub my head and get that off of there. So see, it's just like a little brush, like a floppy brush on this end and a stiff brush. And I'm like, it's wearing down. I have like, but it's just, it's literally, it's like blush. It's that same, oh. <laughs> I'm looking at you. It's the same kind of stuff. And you just brush it on your roots and it just covers them up. Cool, huh? Oh, it would be so much easier if I was just gray. Ugh, cheaper. A lot cheaper, too. Anyway, now I just got that all over my desk. Okay, so I'm going to go get my breakfast, and I'll be back at the end of the day to tell you how it went. All right, see ya. Hey, guys, I just got home from work. I got some sweet gifts. A really cute infinity scarf. It's like purples and blues and greens. And then... I got a creative paper quilling set, so I'm going to learn how to quill, which was awesome. She knows I love doing stuff with paper. And the girls have been baking while I was at school. Here, so there's a lot of stuff. So, so what's this one? Those are cookies. Those are just like the pre-made. Okay. Take, like the take, sugar cookies? Yeah. There was no time put into decorating. Okay. So that's why they look like that. All right. These yes. are all the donuts. They made mini donuts. If you're going to eat them, eat from these two plates first. Why? Before you start from that. Oh, from the fancy? Yes. Like really fancy butter. plate? And this was the first one. And They're very good. We did that and like we screamed because it was so nice. <laughs> you screamed when you did it? Um, I was showing the pictures <laughs> to them at work. This is a snowman. Yes. <laughs> this is this gonna interpretive be a house. cookies? Yes. These were the big ones and the ones that <laughs> were trash. So we put them all on a plate. Hey, they're so. still edible, man. Yeah. Eat so you guys use the little donut maker? Uh-huh. 
When did you get this, Bryn? I can't remember. Did Annette give it to her? Oh, did Annette give it? Oh, yeah, yeah, Annette gave it to her. It's a little sunbeam donut maker. Well, that's good, guys. There's 56 You're... donuts, and we each ate a couple. 56 donuts? I think there were like six of you. Ooh, so, what, so now I don't, I'm confused. What can I eat? The plates need to be gone first before oh, the plates? you start on the, pl on the oh. platter. Can I have one of these? Mm-hmm. They're all stuck together. <laughs> Mm. Very good. Mm -hmm. Cool. That's awesome, guys. You guys are watching a bit of Moana. Bring your right. Just having a lazy day. Oh my god, I'm off. Like, I can't believe I'm off work. <sighs> it's a weird feeling. It doesn't really hit me yet. So. I have to do a little bit more shopping. I have to get one more thing for the girls and one more thing for Scott. So I might do that tomorrow. Um, yeah. And then I think the girls are going out tonight. I think they're babysitting. No, Bryn's babysitting. Kerrigan's going to a movie. So... We're just gonna hang out. I'm just gonna tidy my craft room. I started to tidy it last night. I was talking to, or was it this morning? I was talking, who was I talking to last night, Dad? Anyway, I took my yarn drawer and I just kind of straightened it up a little bit, tidied it up a little bit. So I'm gonna do that with each of my drawers and just get sorted. Um, with what I have. So I mentioned to you guys that I'm gonna be, I can have my window open. Let some light in before it goes away. Um, my hair is sticky. One of the kids, <laughs> she's, a, she's a rascal. She kind of threw pop into my hair, so it's a little sticky. So I gotta go <laughs> wash that later, and I've got that spray in my hair, so I gotta get all that out um, before tomorrow. Um, oh, just having a moment where I'm realizing I'm done for the next, like, week and a half. We don't go back until the 2nd of January. Oh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. I have 12 days off. Oh, so excited. So I'm just gonna like, just, just tidy, uh, my craft room and the kids, God bless them. They were home today and they cleaned their rooms. They cleaned their bathroom and they did that baking. And I think they did the dishwasher. I don't, I can't see it from here. So it's just going to be so relaxing and I can like sit down later and work on my cross stitch. Maybe come up with some craft ideas. Oh, so I was telling you guys that I'm going to do a little bit of break from this channel when I'm done with Vlogmas. And I still can't figure out if I should finish Christmas Day or if I should finish Christmas Eve or if I should finish New Year's Eve. For my craft channel, I'm putting more focus into that. Um, so yeah, I want to do some videos possibly starting in January. And what it's going to be about is about this spending freeze I have. So because I can't spend any money on my craft supplies, um, then I'm going to work with what I have in my craft room. So that's going to be project life. It's going to be paintings that I will do sketching that I'm going to do. I had done some videos about like sketching supplies and stuff like that. So I'm going to put some of those videos up. I still have to edit them, but at least I hope they're still on my iMovie somewhere. Um, but it was about sketching and I'm going to do sketching, like urban sketching stuff like that. So I'll do some different, um, sketching things and I have a cross stitch video that I'm going to edit maybe later tonight or tomorrow or something. I've got cross stitch. I've got knitting. I might do another knitting video. Um, I have a baby blanket that I started to make for somebody when we lived in Bermuda and it was supposed to be a woman that I worked with at Windreach. She was pregnant and I found that out before we moved and I started making this baby blanket and I never did get it done. So it's probably going to go to my grandchild someday, but it's a really cute pattern. It's really sweet. So I might try to do a tutorial on how to do that. I have a crochet blanket that I want to finish. 
Um, I have some drawings that I want to put up on my shop, which I don't know if they're going to go on my Etsy shop or if I'm going to rework my website and get the drawings up on there instead and sell stuff from my website. Because I used to do that when we were in Bermuda. I used to sell from my website. There's just a lot of Etsy fees and a lot of PayPal fees. And yeah, so I don't know what to do with that. So anyway, still thinking. Um, I could do some watercolor painting. Um, what else do I have? Oh, the quilling that I'm going to learn how to do from the book that I got um, from my friend at work. Um, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. There's so many things that I could, I could, oh, the um, needle felting stuff. I could do a little video about that. So yeah, so I think they're just going to be like videos of stuff I'm working on um, this coming year. So yeah, we'll see. Maybe some bobbin lace. Everybody asks me about bobbin lace and I'm a little nervous about doing the bobbin lace again because I haven't done it in so long. And I know the second I bring it out, I might have to watch my own videos, but I know the second I bring it out, I'll have it figured out again. Um, which reminds me, I have to send a Christmas letter to my, um, to Gail, my lace teacher who is in Bermuda. I hope she's well. I know she had some health issues this, um, this year. So I'm praying to God she's okay. Cause I haven't heard from her. Um, so yeah, I really hope she's all right. We're just going to get creative in 2018 and we're going to get creative for cheap. I also had somebody ask me, I don't know if she watches this channel, but she asked me about how to get started in scrapbooking. You don't need all this stuff. You really don't. <laughs> you really don't. It's just fun to have. But I literally started off with my scrapbook stuff in the black cabinet that's in my living room when we were in Florida and that's all I had. And I did have some scrapbook stuff. I did have some craft stuff when we lived in Canada, had a little bit on my desk and I had my little, you know, thing of scissors and stuff like that. I had a few little things to start out with. Um, and then I bought some more things and I bought my Cricut right here, my Cricut, um, got that. Uh, when, when we were in Florida, that's not my original Cricut. I had a beige one, like the, the, the beige Cricut expression, and then it broke. And then I ended up getting a refurbished one that they sent me in Bermuda and it showed up and it was red. I'm like, that's so cool. Cause my other one was like beige and my friends and I had all named our, um, Cricut machines. My first one was Mickey and for Mickey Mouse. And then I named this one Lorraine because it had, it was red and red Cardinal and my mom. So Lorraine is actually my mom's name. So that's why that's there. Someone had asked me about that. Maybe we can play with the cricket. Let's dig out the crickets and dust them off. Um, I know I haven't used mine in a while, but maybe we can do stuff with that. Um, and I have like a ton of cricket cartridges, like they're all up top here. Um, so maybe we can make stuff with our crickets. So yeah, we don't need to buy anything. We really don't. I mean, I'm saying a spending freeze. I'm not going out and buying stuff. If I need a new blade or something for something, I might have to go do that. It's kind of cheating a little bit, but I mean, if my machine doesn't work because I need a blade to make it work, I might have to get something like that. Or we just don't cut anything with the machine. <laughs> we'll knit or something. Anyway. All right. I am on a bit of a sugar high. I had a cupcake at work and I just had a sugar cookie. <laughs> and some pop. I had some pop, which is the pop that got spilt into my hair. So that's the end of day 20. Hope you guys are doing good. I'm going to go enjoy the first part of my vacation. All right. I'll be back tomorrow. Okay. See you guys.